Oh, I'm Carl Thomas. Me and my wife, Margaret, have been here since uh, 2010. We farm here at Manaroo. We are on 100 hectares, carved down about 350 Jersey cows. Before we put the rubber matting in, it was just that hesitation to standing them off for long periods. So I just wanted to get away from having to leave them in the paddock on wet days and damaging pasture and things like that. So slipping and, and stuff like that. And also because we have cows that, that will carve on here at times. For the first couple of times, the, the, the cows noticed the noise and it was a bit like a, a clapping noise. So they were a little bit worried, but after another couple of days, they were fine. There were cows sitting down on it, they were waiting to be milked. So in the mornings, they're coming up here at about four o'clock. So they'll have their amazing meal on the pad at the moment. And most of them will always stand on, the, on here instead of standing on the aprons. They only stand on the aprons when they're ready to be milked pretty much. But during the season, we do run a split herd and they will come and wait for the young herd to be milked. Even if they're not getting fed on here, they're quite happy to sit down and wait instead of standing and wait. Whereas they never used to do that before. The biggest problem was any cows that would get staggers would just not be able to stand up on the pad because it would get slippery and they lose their confidence and they'd just go down. You'd end up picking cows up, so this it's stop that straight away. So far, yeah, I think it's been a very beneficial map for us. Definitely would recommend it, yes. Definitely recommend it as a good product. And I'd be prepared to put it on to other parts of the yard and stuff like that because it certainly takes away any slippage and any damage that can come of it.